Hey y'all, so it's 5.43. I don't know why my phone is doing that, or that's the camera. But, well, it's 5.44 now. I was supposed to get up at 5 freaking 15. But I went back to sleep and I'm so tired. But I'm gonna go ahead and get up right now, so. I look like so busted. Ignore me. My eyes are so puffy today. I don't know why. Like usually when I wake up, I know my eyes are super puffy, but today they extra puffy. Ew. Ooh, I don't like that. Hey YouTube. <coughs> hey YouTube, it's a shy today. And today, y'all. <laughs> Hey YouTube, it's Nashari today, and today I am back in the cut with another video. So guys, as you can tell by the title, today is just a regular school get ready with me chit chat edition. I don't know what I'm going to talk about, but, yeah. I'm hecka tired, and uh, I went to sleep early last night. I usually go to sleep around 12-ish, like, not 12, but like 12.30, 12 12.45, 12, 12, something like that. And I went to sleep at 11 last night, like, and I was trying to go to sleep earlier because, like, I'd be so tired during the day. I realized, like, when I go to sleep after 12, my day is going to be trash. Well, not trash, but I'm going to be so sleepy. And when I'm sleepy, I'm irritated. When I'm irritated, my day is going to be trash. So I try to go to sleep a little bit earlier now. They're so puffy today. Look, they going down though. And look at that big behind bump, so ghetto. And that's crazy, cause I really don't get pimples like that. Like I get breakouts, but I don't get pimples. Like I don't get them like that. Like maybe like twice a month. Like honestly, like I don't. I get breakouts, but I don't get like pimples, like red pimples. But yeah, I'm gonna glue my wig down, cause I already know that joint is not on my head at this point. But I still. Today's Friday, by the way, and I think this weekend I'm gonna change my part to a middle part because I'm tired of this side part. It was cute at first, but now I'm bored, so definitely wanna change that. I decided to sit down today because usually I stand up when I get ready. For some reason in the morning, I just don't wanna sit down because then I be getting tired. But today my legs were hurting, so I didn't wanna sit up, so. So guys how are you i'm thriving well really it depends on like what you're talking about because i'm thriving in some areas and other areas not so freaking much but hey at least i'm not not thriving at all <laughs> right right honestly these past couple of weeks i guess that like i haven't been uploading or whatever i've been like really like what's the word not hesitant not hesitant but like i've been really really not skeptical either but it's like i don't know basically like i've been thinking a lot about youtube if that makes sense i was just trying to like figure out if like youtube is something that i actually want to do because honestly i think i said it in one of my videos but i don't even know if it's uploaded because i suck that freaking hard so i know i've said this on camera before but i don't know if it's on youtube or it's just like i filmed the video and said it but it's not on my channel but basically i was saying i don't know if i suck and i'm just hecka lazy 
which honestly I thought that at first I thought that I was just really lazy like now that it's like affecting me more and more I don't think it's because I'm just lazy like I feel like I'm lazy to an extent like I'm lazy but I know how to get stuff done because if I was super duper lazy like I would not get anything done like you know type stuff like that so I know I'm not like unacceptably lazy i know that because i know myself so at this point regarding youtube i'm trying to figure out what it is that makes me like like hate it not hate it but like i like here let me just break it down don't judge me. i like filming videos i really do like filming videos but when it comes to editing editing is the most Oh my god, I hate editing. Like it just it just it's so much work and I'm so freaking like ugh. Maybe I don't like editing right now because like my YouTube channel kind of sucks right now. So maybe it's like I'm putting in so much work and I'm not like receiving the results I want back. But like of course that's not really an excuse. But I feel like just being a human, if you're putting a lot of effort into something and you're not getting what you should be getting out of it, you're gonna be like what the frick like that's just human but all i'm saying is i really need to uh learn how to get past that and keep it pushing because if i keep that mentality i'm not gonna get anywhere because if i'm lazy and don't like be consistent that's not gonna help me get my channel to where i want to be because obviously the issue that's bothering me the most with youtube right now is my channel is not where i want it to be so i think that's like honestly the like most unmotivating thing ever but the thing is it should be more motivating to me because if i don't like the place i'm in right now i should try my best to try to improve and get out of it but you know i mean i know what i should be doing but it's just like it's easier said than done if that makes sense i've been trying to like refine that spark in me from when i very first started my channel because obviously when i very first started my channel i didn't have nothing but 100 subscribers and nothing but 200 300 views each video if that was happening i didn't stop or i didn't like get lazy or anything and even now that i have more subscribers like that's still like not the point like it's not like oh i got a whole bunch of subscribers and then i got lazy not a whole bunch of subscribers but i gained subscribers and then i got lazy like it's not like i feel comfortable i actually feel super uncomfortable but yeah that's basically it i'm just trying to get out of that and then it's like i'm a procrastinator like i feel like when it comes to youtube i'm super organized like i have a planner for youtube i have a board in my room i have two boards in my room for youtube well it's not just for youtube but mostly for youtube there's no reason i shouldn't be sticking to my uploading schedule but i feel like when it comes to like actually doing stuff i suck i just want to get back uploading regularly like uploading regularly was like really motivating because it's like i'm actually doing something but like right now it's just like it's basically like i'm stuck in a like this little hole where it's just like no motivation no inspiration like it's just like ugh, like it's like a hassle to edit and i don't want to feel like that basically not to edit but like youtube period it's like a hassle and like once you get so far in a hole it's really hard to get out honestly i'm trying not to make excuses but i'm gonna get there i'm gonna get there but i'm trying guys but i feel like i could definitely try harder i know that for a fact because i know myself and i know if i want to do something and i put my mind to it oh honey best believe i'm gonna do it but i think right now it's just the fact that my channel sucks and that's like super like it's like oh it like hurts me it's like girl you suck but obviously my channel's gonna continue to suck if i don't start changing something i hate youtubers that will sit there and complain about their views or their channel not doing as well as they want you can't really complain about that because that's just not like anybody's fault but yours well i'm not saying it's your fault or anything it's nobody's fault but you should probably just take a step back and analyze yourself and try to do something different to see if that works like if you're not getting the results you want back then like maybe switch your content up or be more consistent or upload more or you know do videos that you know are popular type of stuff like you can't really be upset at like your subscribers or youtube or whatever you're upset at you just gotta you know buckle up and do what you gotta do you know what i'm saying but yeah, that's really it about like YouTube. Like I actually genuinely enjoy doing YouTube. Like if you watched my first video, if you like have been here since the beginning, you know that I've always wanted a YouTube channel since I knew what YouTube freaking was. Like 
I've always, always, always wanted a YouTube channel. That's no freaking doubt. But I'm saying though, like, I should definitely make a video of like what YouTubers don't tell you or like what people don't know about YouTube because I used to think, like when I'm watching YouTube videos, I used to think like, oh, I can do that. You literally just film and edit and upload. Like it really takes a lot of time and effort. YouTube can seriously be a full-time job. YouTube is something serious. YouTube is not like easy. It's really not, so. And then everybody's been complaining about like YouTube dying out or like YouTube and like the money part of it. Well, how I feel about that is YouTube dying out. I don't think that can, that's not true at all. I feel like some YouTubers are dying out, like people are dying out, but like as far as the platform itself, I don't feel like it's dying out because YouTube could probably never die out just because of like the principle behind it. Like YouTube is not just where people record their faces and put it on the internet. Like YouTube is actually a helpful app. Like baby, without YouTube, I wouldn't know how to do a lot of stuff. YouTube is really helpful for a lot of things other than vlogs and get ready with me and stuff like that, yada, yada, yada. So YouTube probably won't ever die out. Maybe YouTube would die out in a certain like aspect, but like the whole platform itself, could never. Like basically I'm saying maybe YouTube will eventually die out in beauty grooves or maybe it'll die out in nail videos or makeup videos, you know, stuff like that. But like, I don't feel like it ever, well, I can't speak for the future, but I don't feel like it'll die out like period anytime soon. That's a, that's, that's a stretch for real. Regarding the payment part, I don't care. Like I care, but to a certain extent, like it's not bothering me. Like source of income that I was getting from YouTube is nice. It's nice to have my own money and stuff. Now that I'm like older, like that's not really like really what I'm here for. Cause at one point in time I was on YouTube and not making money and I was fine. So yeah, I do kind of feel like YouTube isn't paying as much like it's kind of been noticeable to me. But like I said, I thought it was just me and my videos. I was like, well, my videos aren't even doing well, so I don't expect you know, a lot of money, you know what I'm saying? So that's really it. I need to hurry up, because I still have to do my freaking makeup or whatever. And well, my makeup don't even take that long. And I know what I'm wearing, so I should be like fine pretty much. But yeah, I wear makeup now or whatever. Because I remember my first YouTube video, I made it super clear that I do not wear makeup. Do not, do not, do not. I made it very freaking clear that I rock lashes and lip gloss. Don't play with me. But now, like, I wear makeup to school and stuff. Well, like, I wear makeup, period. But, like, say I'm, like, going to the store. I'm not going to go put a full face of makeup on. And by the way, by makeup, I obviously don't mean a full face, like, beats like my face beat it's like the most natural it can get it's like a natural beat basically so yeah that's really it so basically all i wear is like foundation concealer you know setting powder lashes highlighter and lip liner and really the only reason i started wearing makeup is honestly because it's fun to do like it really is like one day when i woke up in the morning i was like i'm gonna do my makeup and then a lot of people actually like didn't even notice i started wearing makeup like when i said something about it they was like i didn't even notice until you said something I was like, oh wow, so that's that's a good thing because so, that means I'm not wearing too much where I look like a completely different person or people like can tell. That's like the, the main thing with me. Like I shouldn't be able to tell if she has makeup on. Well, it depends on what kind of look you're going for. I'm going for like the natural. So yeah, that's really it. guys so i'm not straightening my hair so next i'm just gonna start my makeup because like well, there's nothing else to do basically huh?
I start doing my face makeup, I'm gonna go put my shirt on because my shirt is black and listen, that's like a recipe for freaking disaster. So I'm just gonna go put my shirt on. Okay guys, so I got my shirt on now and it's a turtleneck so that's why like I kinda had to put it on because listen, that would've been really hard to try to get on without getting my makeup on it. But I'm just gonna do my face makeup now and yeah, that's it. Now I'm taking my airspun setting powder. I'm just gonna set in all the places I put concealer. <laughs> I can't talk. So now I'm taking my beauty blender and I'll blend everything together one more good time. It looks like this. Oh, my camera battery's about to die. Ah! OMG, my camera is about to die. By the way, guys, I'm wearing this purse with my outfit. It's 743. So guys, that was my outfit, and that's basically it for this video. Don't forget to give this video a like, feel free to comment, and don't forget. Most importantly, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Yeah, going in like you go. Move out the way, please don't be a hero. Bling, bow, ooh. She no skateboard, please.